Hi beauties. So today I'm gonna do a day of the dead look for Halloween. I have not done this before. This is literally my first time trying it out. So it's gonna be very interesting. I'm probably gonna mess up a lot and it's not gonna look like the inspo that I have. But anyways, I went to Spirit Halloween. I got a colossal makeup kit and it came with a bunch of different face paints and a bunch of different of these uh, crayon things. Some glitter gel, some cream makeup, and sponges and brushes and stuff like that. And then I also have vampire blood and stuff I'm not gonna use. So if you did see my um, story that I posted, I'm not using everything in that kit. So don't get too excited. <laughs> so first, before any makeup look, we gotta use that primer. So this is the Smashbox, Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. And I'm gonna use that to help my makeup stay on better, go on smoother, fill in those pores, all that good stuff. So I'm gonna get that on. So I just wanna show you guys my inspo. So here it is on the screen. It's very colorful. Um, we have the red lipstick instead of making the lips actually look like teeth. And instead of the jewels, I'm gonna be using some glitter. It's not gonna be exactly the same because I'm not skilled at face paint. This is just an inspo. So don't think that this is gonna look extravagant. But anyways, I just wanted to show you that. And first I'm gonna use my little crayon thing right here and just sketch out the eyes. Oh, I just got it all under my nail. Okay, so let's get going. I'm just gonna sketch it out. So don't think this is gonna look like a perfect shape. I'm going to fill it in. Can't tell if this is above the eyebrow, but let's just assume. So now that I sketched that out, I'm gonna use the little brush that it came with. This is a very terrible quality brush. So I may have to switch to one of my nice brushes, but I really don't wanna get face paint on it. So I'm gonna try this first. I'm gonna dip it in some water and get my black on there. And let's see how this works. Wow, that looks terrible. <laughs> I think I might've put too much water. Technical difficulties. So now that I got my black eyes, I'm going to go into that white cream and I'm going to cover the rest of my face. I don't know if I'm doing this in the right order. I might, I think I'm supposed to do my nose first, but I don't really know, so I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> I'm just gonna start out with a little bit because I really don't know how much comes out on here. Like I said, never done this before, so. So as you can see, 
This is coming out terribly, so that's cool. <laughs> I'm not used to costume makeup and I forgot how like really bad quality it is. Like it's literally drying and then coming up when I touch it again. But uh, we're gonna wing it. So let's try to keep going. So I tried to fix this white, but when I added more on, it just took the rest off. So I'm gonna stop doing that and just try to move on from this because I'm getting frustrated. <laughs> so I'm gonna start with the eyes. I'm gonna use that yellow and just do a ring around each of my circles. Next, I'm gonna create a kind of like flower look around the yellow with that red. <clears throat> I'm sorry, my throat keeps acting up and there's nothing I can do about it, so. Next, I'm gonna use my black and I'm just going to outline the circles and add some little dots for more design. Next, I'm going to do the flower right on the top of the forehead. So I'm gonna start with that yellow. And then I'm going to go into that blue. And then I'm gonna outline it with purple. lastly in black. Next I'm going to do the chin and then I'm going to go right into the small linear details. So I'm going to start with that little flower bad but it doesn't look great either <laughs> but I'm gonna try to finish it at least I'm gonna do the nose next and then the lips and then I'm gonna try to add some glitter instead of those jewels that my inspo photo has so let's give this a shot Mm. 
Next, I'm gonna move on to the lips. So I'm gonna use the Beauty For Real lipstick by, oh, maybe that's the brand. Beauty For Real Really Red Lip Cream. All right, let's see if this is what I want. So I think it's a little redder than I wanted, but oh well, I'm gonna try to move on. So let's create those lines on the lips. I did the lips I kind of wish that I got in like, like a an eyeliner to do this instead because the lines are way too thick but whatever still looks okay so now I'm gonna move into that glitter and I'm just going to create some access accent points You guys can see the glitter that I added. Obviously it's not gonna look like Jules, like the picture, but I was trying to work with only that one kit and I'm not gonna lie, wasn't the greatest kit in the world. Very bad quality. Didn't come with all the right tools, but I mean, came out okay. I definitely wouldn't say um, it looks like a professional did it, but I could go out on Halloween like this. <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoyed my video. I know this didn't come out as great as I had hoped, but hopefully this helps you when you're looking for your Halloween makeup. You can go to Spirit Halloween, totally up to you. Just be prepared, it's very bad quality and you may not have everything you need. So just research before you go, make sure it's gonna be good for what you wanna do. But anyways, I hope you guys are staying safe. Don't go to big Halloween parties, wear your mask, be safe this Halloween, let's not make the coronavirus cases go up because that would be very sad but anyways have a great day don't forget to like and subscribe and i will see you next time bye